happen? Our walls are impenetrable. Your floor isn't. Well then, if death is what you seek, then I will gladly provide it. There is no reason to be hostile, Your Majesty. In fact, you should be proud. Your son is moments away from inheriting the throne. Dale! I tried, Father. What do you want with us? How shall I explain this? I'm gifting your son with my knowledge. It will make him the most powerful ruler your world has ever known. And he will answer to no one but me. A crisis has befallen our world. For centuries we have depended on the Kingdom Stone, but its strength is fading. It cannot keep up with our growing demand for energy. The Prince of Shrigar, poisoned with madness over the death of his father, has spread machines across the land to steal energy from other kingdoms. Tensions are growing, and I fear that war may be inevitable. Hello everyone and welcome to Freedom Planet. Now Freedom Planet is a Kickstarter game. Um, I can't exactly remember when it was, but it was uh, probably about a year ago. And it's been released, well, relatively recently. And uh, it, it's made in the, you know, it's inspired by such side scrollers as Sonic the Hedgehog. So, uh, well, let's go on and do what it says and press start. Okay, so I've gone through and I've already changed my uh, controls to how I want them to. Um, this is, I'm using an Xbox controller. Um, controls weren't exactly set up quite right. Um, now I I will admit I've already been through this first stage, um, however, well, I went through it in the previous recording and it failed horribly, so let's start with a new file on adventure. Looks like a nice view. And we've got a nice meteor. Oh, wait, that's not a meteor. Doesn't look like one anyway. Is that some kind of spaceships? Oh, that's the uh, creature from the introduction scene. Through daylight in the Valley of the East. Oh, that doesn't look good for that, uh... That really doesn't look good for that. Oh! Where are you going? I have to make sure they're okay. Indeed, we have to make sure they're okay. Can't you be little Miss Hero Pants some other time? Not a chance! Fine, I'll go by myself. Alright, so for this first stage, I'll be choosing Lilac, because uh, I've played through Lilac the first time around, but uh, alright, so just to re-familiarise myself with the controls, we've got a jump, we've got a kind of double jump, which she calls a cyclone, and we have a super spinny-like thing, but we can go off into the air as well, and we have an attack. So, let's move on. Oh, and uh, got our first enemy here, and you have to be quite careful with those, um, in the way they shoot. They do come off, well, from the off-screen off uh, quite nice. Oh. oh, um, okay, don't have to kill you. Fair enough. Um, right, so these blue things, uh, well, I would say they're kind of like rings in Sonic the Hedgehog, but they're not exactly rings because they don't relate to your life in any sense. So what they, um... As you can see, the counter is going down, so when they reach zero, we get ourselves an extra life. Anyway, let's move on and, uh... Oh! Missed it. Oh, oh. what was that? One of those creatures. 
one of those uh, helicopters from before. So I'm guessing going left is probably the wrong way. Hmm. Got some kind of fuel canister here. I wonder if that's for um, Carol. Whoa. Okay, let's move on. Okay. And just like Sonic the Hedgehog, we have our springs. And these leaves, as they're supposed to be, and they don't quite look like leaves to me in all cases, but uh, never mind, they're, um, they're our health. Alright, and let's bounce on up, and I presume we're meant to climb up this ladder. Oh, a nice flower there, that gives us... oh! So, what's this? Oh! Invincibility! Okay, so that there is a uh, 1-up. Okay, so it's just pure invincibility, you don't like destroy all creatures as you go through. I haven't actually come across this... this uh, I don't know what it was before. Anyway, um... Let's get on back up here, and... well, not that high. Let's uh, take the upper road, and ooh! Got a nice set of uh, blue diamonds here. Okay. Hmm. Okay, uh, let's go on and grab a few more of these. Uh, okay. So, Lilac here is what's known as a, a creature known as a dragon, I believe. Um, never really heard of them before, but even so, uh, seems to do. Hmm, I wonder. Aha! I guess that's what you're meant to do. Let's grab a bit more health. Um, and I believe Carol from before is a wildcat. Um, might need to be corrected there, but... Uh... Oh! What the? Okay! That's a bit of a bug. Okay, so what we have to do here is destroy this enemy and live to get past. Ow! There we go. So that will destroy the wall, and get a nice spring here so we can get all the uh, blue things. And then we move on to the next era, well, the next part of the stage. So a new gimmick here, we've got uh, air flows, or something like that. we got ourselves a chest with something inside, I'm guessing that's probably health. Ah, gotta love the uh, bridges that go down like this. Sorry, I, 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 I am a bit of a old school Sonic fan, okay? So, when I see loop-de-loop -loop like that, then, uh, well, I go all crazy. Alright, let's... So, the way these abilities work is, is the blue bar on the top left, if you haven't noticed, um, which uh, recharges over time, and uh, that powers both the Cyclone and what I shall call the super spin, because why not? Um, however, you can only do the super spin when the bar is at full. Like a cyclone, you can do it any time. Now, this door we can't get through right now. And if I'm... Yeah, so when these things are shining, you jump on them and you get a few more of the uh, diamond things. Oh! Grab that uh, before. Well, sorry, hit that creature before. Hmm. I do wonder what those are. Maybe they've probably got something to do with Carol's gameplay style. Alright. Hmm. Oh! Um. I honestly don't know what those cards are, but uh, this is a block that we most likely need back down here for the Switch. And. So it is. All right, let's move on. Ah, that's interesting. 
interesting bit of coding there. Must um, actually unload off the stuff off the screen that's not being used. Anyway, let's grab a few more of the diamonds. I, I really need to figure out what they actually called. Oh, and those things are coming out. I honestly don't know what they are. And yep, you can also hit enemies with your cyclone. And we get ourselves a shield here. Very classic Sonic. Anyway, let's get moving on. Oh, there's a few more things up here. We're so close to getting a new life. And there we go. One up. <laughs> Fantastic. So, what else is that this game? The, the controls are very... They're very responsive. And I think I'm going the wrong way. So... Let's head on back up. Um, now one thing I will say is those who have played Sonic, this definitely doesn't control exactly like a Sonic game. Um, the speed your character goes at is not really momentum based, it's just more like a standard Mario platformer I guess in terms of the speed that you move. You start off a bit slow, you speed up and oh! Whoa! What's this? It's the boss! At least, uh, actually, in reality, it's a mini boss. Okay. Oh no. Phew. All right. There we go. Got it. And it opens up an area to next spot. And it's just me. Or did the music change? I didn't notice that before. Anyway, let's spin on down here. And sorry, I I don't want that. Okay. Move on down here. Um, of course, when I say it's more like Mario, the speed that you can actually go at is definitely much faster than Mario. All right, have to wait for the speed gauge to go, so we can come up here. And oh, Not exactly what I was wanting to do. Oops, I mean to wait for that to finish. Ah. Oh. <sighs> Try it one more time. There we go. Got it. Ah, it looks like those cards actually store up over playthroughs, so it's... Hmm, that's interesting. Um, oh, and... Yep, uh, she can swim. As well. Oh, let's try and avoid that. And what's this up here? Aha! Oh! Gotta grab all this. Gotta grab what you can, right? And... Yep, that's knockout as well, but... Oh! Let's, uh... Get out of this water, and... Hmm. Okay, so you're gonna do left cut from the ground, okay. Um and I failed that again, so let's grab this health. Um it, it looks like that any health you get when you've um, already at max health it converts to the diamonds or crystals or whatever they're called. Anyway, next screen. Move on over here. And Ah, uh, I forgot about. Oh, we can push these. Okay. I did not know that. Ah, we get ourselves a shield. And, oh, back up here. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, let's come back down here. We, we do definitely have a... Uh, a gauge for breathing, but... I've yet to actually see it go down, even without this shield that I've currently got, which looks like it could be some kind of water shield. Uh, and that looks like it's meant to be classic air bubbles from Sonic the Hedgehog, kind of, except 
not because you just stand at them at the bottom. And hopefully there's no horrifying music as well when you start running out of uh, energy. Alright, let's uh, keep on moving on here. Huh, what's that? Never mind. Let's keep on moving on forward. Um, okay, waterfalls. This is giving me uh, flashbacks of the jungle zone. Oh, and looks like we've got ourselves a boss here yeah, trying to kill us. Still, we've got to be careful. As uh, I just lost my shield. All right, this should do. It. Let's keep on moving forward. Let's go down. Let's go down here. Why not? No way you can get through. Hmm. hmm. You know, I feel like killing this thing. Ow! Get any rewards? Yes, we do. Great. Alright, let's keep on moving forward. Hmm. No, uh, right, yeah, you can't. It spin straight up. Okay. Hmm. Oh! Almost didn't see that. And now, if I remember correctly. Oh! Hmm. Come down here, and that will break a bridge down below, but. But, I've just seen something up above that I want to get. And no, not like that. <sighs> right. That isn't exactly what I wanted to do, but never mind. There we go. Grab another one of those cards. Whoa! Let's keep on moving forward, and I believe this was the one that broke open. Oh, there's still enemies here, so... And uh, there's still crystals here, which is probably the more important thing, so... Doubt they respawn, but you never know. Ah, you can see the air gauge on the left suddenly is going down, actually. Maybe it was a glitch from before. Um, where it wasn't going down. Who knows? Alright, let's uh, grab a bit more... Well, call it health, but it's not really. Whoa! Now watch out for these trees as they're... Uh... Hmm. Not exactly any ordinary trees. Let's put it that way. Alright, let's move on forward. Okay. Whoa! Let's keep on moving forward. Okay. Um. Is that meant to happen? Oh! Ow! Okay. Yeah, another boulder comes. Okay, fair enough. Let's keep moving forward. And we end up. Ow! Oh. Okay, let's try and avoid these boulders. As we get our boss returning. And, oh. Ow! Come on. Alright, let's uh, get out of this. And we hit it once. Um, well, in the head. Uh, I think it's three times you have to hit it in the head. Um, I can't quite remember. Okay, well, be careful now. My health's getting a bit low. Two. And let's dodge these rocks. Okay. And there we go with a uh, super spin at the end. And there we go, folks. End of stage one. Thank you for watching, and hope you have a good day. See you next time. And we've also got some things unlocked as well. Um, sorry for the 
few cuts at the end there. Okay, see you next time.